Edge of the Rock, sit at the head of the table. Moody Roman, a poor Muslim. I'm the best of the best. I'm your tribal chief. I'm the head of the table. I'm the greatest universal champion of all time. Should the rock sit in a booth? Should the rock sit at the bar? Or should the rock sit at the head of the table? <laughs> the Rock name drops Roman Reigns because The Rock wants to sit at the head of the table. To sit at the head of the table, one must be invited to a dinner of relevancy. The Rock has not been invited, nor will he be, because The Rock is just like everybody else. He's looking for a shortcut to the headlines. There's only two ways in this world to guarantee going viral. One, date Taylor Swift. Two, call out Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns wins a match, out comes John Cena. Roman Reigns wins a match, out comes Brock Lesnar. Roman Reigns beats Cody Rhodes. Cody Rhodes still talking about finishing his damn story. CM Punk comes back to WWE after 10 years. Welcome back. CM Punk says he's the OG Paul Heyman guy, which he is, till I upgraded from best friend to advocate and upgraded from advocate to wise man. Tonight, Randy Orton, AJ Styles, and LA Knight all fight for the privilege of getting smashed by Roman Reigns at the Royal Rumble, and the one man that wins tonight will be smashed by Roman Reigns at the Royal Rumble the same way whomever opposes Roman Reigns in the main event of WrestleMania will be smashed by your tribal chief, smashed by the head of the table, smashed by the undisputed heavyweight champion of the world. Because there's not one man on the face of this planet that can beat Man, I told you, one man can't beat me. Nobody can. Just like you said, nobody. Um, I know that my tribal chief and Nick Aldis knows that too. Which is why Nick Aldis just made the title match at the Royal Rumble a fatal four-way. I'm sorry. Wise man. Yes, my tribal chief. Fix this. Yes, my tribal chief.